Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel, Lesson 8. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to square any number up to 30. So I've got four examples here, two of them I'm going to do step by step, and the other two we're going to try to do them faster. So let's start with this one. Firstly, we're going to square the unit, so 3 squared is going to be 9. Then we're going to find the difference from 10, so going to find the difference of the original number, so 13 minus 10, which is going to be 3. So we are going to write the 3. The reason why we are finding the difference from 10 is because this number starts with 1, so we have to take away from 10. Okay, so after we've done this, we're going to add this difference to the original number. So we're going to add this 3 to the 13, so plus 13. 13 plus 3 is 16. And then we're going to times the 16 by the tens place. So in this case, the tens place is 1. So we're going to do 1 times 16, which is going to give us just 16. And we're going to bring this 9, join them up to give us 169. Okay, so now let's go on to the next one. Don't worry, guys, if you don't understand this yet. By the time we finish with this example, you guys will hopefully get it. Okay, so now, again, we're going to do the same step. So we're going to first square the unit. So we're going to do... 4 squared, which is going to be 16, so write the 6, and we're going to take the 1 as a remainder. Then we're going to find the difference. This time we're going to find the difference from 20, because in this case the number starts with 2. So we're going to do 24 minus 20, which is going to be 4. We are going to write the 4 down. Then we're going to add the difference to the original number, so 24, so plus 24. So now 24 plus 4. Is 28 by the way keep the remainder don't add it to the to this yet just keep the remainder for now now we're going to times it by the tens place the tens place is 2 we are going to do 2 times 28 2 times 28 is 56 we're going to add the 1 now so plus 1 1 plus 56 is 57 and we are going to bring this 6 over so the answer is 576 okay so the answer is 576, guys. I'll explain this question to you guys once more. So firstly, we did the first step, which was to square the units. 4 squared was 16, so we wrote the 6, took the 1 as a remainder. Then we found the difference from 20 because the number starts with 2, so we did 24 minus 20, which gave us 4, so we wrote the 4 down. Then we added this to the original number, which was 24, so we did plus 24. 24 plus 4 was 28. We kept the remainder on for now. We didn't add it up yet. And then we times this by the tens place, which was 2. So we did 2 times 28, which gave us 56. Now we added the remainder, which was plus 1. 56 plus 1 is 57. And then we brought the 6 over, joined the numbers up to get 576. So now let's try doing these questions a bit quicker now. We've got 17 squared. First square the unit, so 49, 9, 4, Find the difference, 17 minus, uh, 17 minus 10, which is going to be 7. Add the original number, plus 17. 17 plus 7 is 24. 24 times 1 is going to be 24. Add the 4. 28. Take the 9. 289. So, well done, guys, for doing this question a bit faster. So, now, let's go on to the next one. Again, with this question, we're going to do it a bit more faster again. So, we're going to do the same steps. 7 squared, 49, take, write the 9, take the 4 as a remainder. Then, we're going to find the difference. 27 minus 20, which is going to be 7. Add the original number, 27, which is going to be 34. Times this by 2, 68. Add the 4, which is going to be 72. Bring the 9 over. So the answer is 729. Okay, so well done, guys, for again doing this question much more quicker. So I've got some questions for you guys to try here. I've got 19 squared and 21 squared for you guys to try. If you guys do find the answers for these questions, the answers in the description below. So go check that out. So that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, give this video a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And if you haven't already subscribed to our channel, please go ahead and subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you don't miss any new uploads. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching.